President Trump is scheduled to interview at least four candidates for the U.S. National Security Advisor position in Florida on Sunday. Speaking to reporters on Air Force One Saturday, Trump said he had many, many that want the job. Trump also hinted he had a favorite to fill the position. I've been thinking about someone for the last three or four days, we'll see what happens, Trump said. I'm meeting with that person. They're all good, they're all great people. Reuters reported that Trump also told reporters on Air Force One that he plans to make a decision over the next couple of days. Scheduled to discuss the job with the president at Mar-a-Lago were his acting adviser, retired Army Lieutenant General Keith Kellogg, John Bolton, a former U.S. ambassador to the United Nations, Army Lieutenant General H.R. McMaster, and the superintendent of the U.S. Military Academy at West Point, Lieutenant General Robert Caslin. White House spokesman Sean Spicer said more meetings for the job could happen, which is now open after retired General Michael Flynn was asked to resign earlier this week. Flynn resigned at Trump's request Monday after revelations that he misled Vice President Mike Pence about discussing sanctions with Russia's ambassador to the U.S. during the transition. Trump said in a news conference Thursday that he was disappointed by how Flynn had treated Pence but did not believe Flynn had done anything wrong by having the conversations. Trump's first choice to replace Flynn, retired Vice Admiral Robert Harward, turned down the offer. Trump tweeted on Saturday that he will be having many meetings this weekend at the Southern White House, 